We are glad you're with us tonight. I'm Lynn Brooks. And I'm Philip Coleman. The acquittal of George Zimmerman has many of those who don't agree with the verdict rallying all across the United States. And the same goes for those here in Alabama. WVUA's Jennifer Edwards joins us now with tonight's top story. That's right, Lynn and Phillip. Today, demonstrators rallied together in Birmingham to show their support for the Martin family and to speak out against the verdict. No justice, no peace. Bull Carter day is over. No peace. No peace. Chants and songs in honor of Trayvon Martin and his family could be heard all across downtown Birmingham. We raise our voices, but we raise them peacefully, we raise them legally, we raise them civilly, and we intend for our voices to be heard. We, heard, we intend for the Zimmermans of the world to hear our voices wherever they go. Demonstrators of all ages filled Kelly Ingram Park today to stand up for what they believe in. We should be able to voice our opinions and be heard and just let folks know that we just don't feel that this was the right thing to do. I'm a Caucasian person and uh, it's important for us to, you know, not make it a black or white thing, but a justice thing. I think it was really kind of unfair because I, I felt like he wasn't bringing any harm to anybody and he died for no reason and it kind of hurts me to think that it could have been my brother or somebody I knew. I want these young girls to not be on the sidelines. I want them to be a part of, of what's going on in this world so they can make a change. You know, be a part of the change, be a part of the solution and not a part of the problem. For others, the drive behind their involvement in the rally is to make sure an incident like this doesn't happen again. We can't bring Trayvon back, but clearly what we can do is step forward to make sure stand your ground laws like the ones in Florida and other places aren't misapplied, aren't abused. Let's make justice for everybody because it could have been my son, your son, anybody's son. So if right is right and wrong is wrong. Now, demonstration organizers told me there is also another honor or another rally in honor of Trayvon Martin planned for next Saturday.